Hello and welcome to the Titus Time Out podcast. I'm Jenny Abney Civy, and I'm on the road all week, so this week's podcast is going to be quick. I'm going to answer the question, what is a VFD? I'm not going to go into the electronics and the details behind how they work. Maybe I'll do that in a later podcast. But today we're just going to talk about the basics of the VFD. VFD stands for Variable Frequency Drive. It's also known by some other names, including variable speed drive and inverter drive. I need a little more room here. As the name implies, VFDs adjust the voltage and frequency to the motor to control the motor speed. Okay, let's scoot this off to the side here. So there are two ways to control the motor to get the airflow you need out of a fan. In a belt drive fan, let's draw a little fan and put the motor here. And that's the belt. So you would change the belt or pulley size to control the speed of the fan, which controls the airflow. You could also have a VFD to adjust the voltage or frequency to the motor, which will control the motor speed and control the airflow that way. Okay, let's pull the other half back on the page and make some room here at the bottom. So, this, so now you can modulate the fan based on the actual building load. Now if you remember from the fan laws podcast, power is proportional to the cube of the speed of the motor. So a VFD will save you energy because you can slow the motor down when you have partial load conditions. VFDs also allow slow startup of the motor, which is better for the motor life. So that's a super quick overview of what a VFD is and why you would use one. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and thanks for taking a time out with us.